including nectar and pollen-rich native flowers in the summer garden, provides essential pollinators, including bees, hummingbirds, and some butterflies and birds, with valuable food sources they need to survive. The following summer-blooming native plants hail from coast to coast. Consider adding one or more to your garden as a way to beautify your outdoor space and support local pollinators. You can plant in summer, but fall is ideal, as cooler temperatures will make it easier for plants to establish themselves. Here are seven best summer flowers that attract hummingbirds and bees. Number one, Black-Eyed Susan. These plant is native to most of North America. Treasured for its sunshine yellow flowers, Black-Eyed Susan shines brightly in cottage and perennial gardens. It's an important food for butterflies and hummingbirds, tolerates dry conditions, and can thrive in most kinds of soil. Black-Eyed Susan plants are drought-resistant, self-seeding and grow in a variety of soils. Growing Black-Eyed Susans prefer a neutral soil pH and a full sun to light shade location. Number 2. Joe Pie Weed this attractive plant produces pale pink-purple flowers that last from midsummer through fall. It's a great addition to nearly any garden and a must-have for wildlife lovers, attracting a multitude of butterflies with its sweet nectar. Growing Joe Pie weed flowers is a wonderful way to bring a little bit of nature to your backyard. There's little maintenance involved with Joe Pie weed care. The plant does enjoy regular, deep watering, and will withstand heat and drought fairly well when the soil is kept moist or shade is provided. A layer of mulch will help retain moisture levels too. Number 3. Trumpet Honeysuckle Woodland gardens in the eastern U.S. can make room for the attractive and well-behaved native trumpet honeysuckle. This flowering vine climbs up arbors, over walls, and on porch railings with small trumpet-shaped flowers opening up for hummingbirds and bees to drink their nectar. The semi-evergreen foliage is deer-resistant. Hummingbirds and native bees feed on its flowers' nectar, birds eat its berries, and butterfly and moth species use it as a host plant. Number 4. Spotted Bee Balm Spotted bee balm is a resilient, low-maintenance, and long-blooming perennial that attracts important pollinators, including bees and wasps, as well as other beneficial insects. Colorful bracts extend the length of time the plant appears to be in bloom. While spotted bee balm is considered to be a short-lived plant, lasting only about three years, it is a vigorous reseeder. It's also deer-resistant. Number 5. Maximilian Sunflower Gardeners and pollinators across North America can enjoy Maximilian Sunflower's towering stalks of summer blooms. Maximilian blooms in late summer into fall, during a lull in the blooming season, and provides necessary nectar and pollen for pollinators. It tolerates many soil types, with the exception of heavy, wet clay. Number 6. Purple Prairie Clover Garden visitors of all sorts can't resist the purple pompoms of purple prairie clover. This drought-tolerant perennial will have your garden abuzz with bees and butterflies in summer. Purple Prairie Clover is a legume, meaning it also is a nitrogen fixer, adding natural fertilizer to the soil. It grows well in heavy clay soils. Well, that's all for today's video, guys. If you like this video, don't forget to click the like and subscribe button for supports our channel. Also, you can turn on the notification bell for latest videos from us. Well, see you in the next interesting topics.